creating balance creating balance see here this is a balance this is a balance creating balance how can we how can we solve how can we balance equation by it is explained by using a balance so see here children how can we balance the equation by using balance in the left side of the pen in the left side of the pen i am placing two cages and in the right side of the pen in the right side of the balance sorry in the right side pen it is a right side pen and it is a left side pen in left side pen i am placing two cages and in right side pen i am placing three cages right so the weight the weight balance it is not balanced it is not balanced because here one kg weight is more than here two kg so it went down so to the right side like that i am placing here five kg and here ten four kg i am placing four kg here i am placing four kg so it is not balanced again it bends down so right side of the left side it bends down to right side like uh, this one it bends like this if you place two cages here and three cages here it bends like this okay it is not balanced how we how how can we balance a weight machine we balance a weight machine by placing equal weights in the right side and left side in the right side and left side we have to place uh, equal weights then only we balance see here i am placing five cages here and also five cages here then we balance it should be like this it should be like this it, it doesn't bend okay it should be in a straight way okay it should be like this five cages here five cages here it is balanced if we place if you add three cages here and also three cages here then also it should be in balanced position because we are placing again same weights see here i am placing in the right side of the pen in the left side of the pen i am placing six cages and in the right side i am placing 10 kg i am placing 12 kg okay 6 kg and 12 kg so it bends down to right side because right side weight is more if you place extra 4 kg 6 plus 4 kg and here i am i'm taking 2 kg away then it should be balanced because 6 plus 4 is equal to 10 Four minus two is also ten. Okay, like that we have to balance the balance the balance. We have to balance this machine. Like that, like that. In this way, we have to balance the equation. Okay, children. Next one is solving the equation. Okay, children. Solving the equation. In the previous class, we solved the solve. We solved the equations by using try and error method. In this class, see how can we solve the equations? X plus three is equal to seven is given. So see here, it is uh, right left hand side means LHS and it is right hand side RHS. So I am taking LHS side X plus three here. LHS have X plus three here. If you see, if you observe here, X in the variable and here you are writing here. So here. In the H S side, plus three is more than X. Here we want only X here. So if you see here, it is plus three is more than X. The value of the value which is in the left hand side is uh, plus three more than X. Here we don't want X value. That's why it is uh, it is plus three more than X. That's why I I I want to remove this plus three. How can we remove this plus three? By subtracting minus three, by subtracting minus three, by subtracting with three, we can remove the value of value three here. So, so see here, subtract. If you subtract anything from anything from the given equation, we have to subtract it from both sides. We have to subtract it from both sides. That's why subtract three. From both sides. 
So we have to subtract 3 from both sides because here plus 3 is more than x. So x plus 3, I am subtracting a 3, value 3. x plus 3 minus 3 is equal to 7. We have to subtract here also minus 3. We have to subtract on both the sides of the equation. So x plus 3 minus 3 equal to 3 minus 3 0 equal to 7 minus 3 4. So the value of x is 4. So the value of x is 4. Now substitute this value of x in the LHS side. So LHS. What is the value of uh, x? 4. That is equal to 4 plus 3 equal to 7. We get LHS is equal to 7. Then what is RHS here? RHS is also 7. Therefore, therefore LHS is equal to RHS. LHS is equal to RHS. Then the equation is solved. We know the value of x here. x is equal to 4. See here children, next problem. y minus 7 is equal to 9. Here, y, y have some value. What is the value? Minus 7 is less than y here. Minus 7 is less than y here. Here, RHS have 9. But in, but in LHS, minus 7 less than, 7 less than y, 7 value, this value, total value is less than 7. How can we tell less than 7? Because here minus 7 here. That's why it is less than 7. So, we can solve it by adding, how can we, how can we take away this 7 here? By adding plus 7. If you add plus 7 here, minus 7 plus 7 is equal to 0. So, the only value y is here. So, add uh, and 7 on both sides. Both sides means left side and uh, right side, left hand side and right hand side. So, y minus 7 plus 7 is equal to 9 plus 7. See here, y minus 7 plus 7. Here, minus 7 plus 7. What is minus 7 plus 7? 0. So, y only here, y left only here, 9 plus 7 is equal to 16. So the value of y is what? What is the value of y here? 16. So take now LHS, substitute, substitute the value of 9. So In y. So y is equal to so we have the equation y plus y minus 7. Y minus 7. Here the value is 16. We have to substitute y is equal to 16. That's why 16 in y. 16 minus 7 is equal to 9. So here it is LHS, left hand side. What is the value of left hand side value? 9. Then what, what is the value of right hand side value here? 9. So RHS is equal to RHS then the value of y is 16. Okay. This method, this method is called uh, without transpose. Without transpose means we, have, we don't transpose any terms here. We don't replace, we don't uh, move any numbers here. See here, this is the problem in uh, another model. y minus 7 is equal to 9. So here minus here y minus 7 we have in left hand side we have y minus 7 so I am taking only y in left hand side I am taking only y in left hand side and I am moving this minus 7 to right hand side if you move negative numbers to right hand side these numbers are transformed into positive numbers so it becomes 9 here minus 7 here so it becomes plus 7 so 9 plus 7 is equal to 16 we get y is equal to 16, then we have to place place or substitute y is equal to 16. Now y 16 minus we don't need to place because we also we move here. That's why we don't need to place the value of y in here. So this is this is the method of transpose. Here we transpose means we move 7 here. 
So this is transposing. This is not transposing. Without transposing, we solve the equation. With the transposing, we solve the equation. Okay, children. Okay, children. See the two problems as one. Thank you, children. Bye. See you tomorrow.